Welcome back everyone. Uh, in this episode, we'll cover the current job market in Australia. So welcome to the lucky country. At this period, um, we can say that Australia is really a unique market in the sense that we are actually enjoying a very, very low unemployment rate. The economy is performing very strong when the rest of the world is mainly into recession. So another aspect of the, of the market is even pre-COVID, uh, some of you are already familiar with kind of skill visa scheme, you know, obviously the number of international students coming to study in Australia, all this has stopped over one year ago with all international borders being closed. I don't have a crystal ball, but at this point of time, I'm taking the bet that the borders won't reopen as we knew it before probably July 2022. What it means is the current market we are in probably is going to reflect or actually be worse in the next um, 12 months in terms of the shortage of talents uh, and workforce in Australia. So basically, you know, what I would say, uh, and you can see here, you know, a number of kind of key figures uh, is the talent pool pre-COVID, you could tap into, doesn't exist anymore. You need to look at local options or offshore options and moving to hybrid model where you could have part of your team working remotely. So one of the key message I want to leave you with is in Australia, more than anywhere else in the world, good talents are on demand and go fast. An example is at the moment we're dealing a number of recruitments. Most of the candidates we're talking to will end up having three job offers by the end of our recruitment process. You probably want to act fast and you know, seek your top talents quickly. Thank you for following this second episode of our video series. In the next episode, we're going to be covering the challenge and opportunities for your startup when hiring top talents. See you soon.